Hi guys, Cheryl here from DIYXE, your resource for sublimation tutorials, print on demand, and digital designs. In today's video, we are gonna be doing a comparison between printed mint and printful. Uh, I've seen a lot on TikTok lately about printed mint having nice packaging and everything, which makes it look a little bit more like it's got that homemade touch. So we're gonna to compare today. Uh, the product I use for comparison is going to be a t-shirt. So first off, talking about logistics, both websites were super easy to use. Getting my design on the t-shirt was easy and getting the order fulfilled. Um, in terms of pricing, the base price for printed mint was a little bit cheaper than Printful, but the shipping was actually more expensive. So when you factored it all together, I ended up paying $2 less for the t-shirt from Printful. In terms of production time and delivering, it took about 10 days for Printful and 20 days for printed mint. Um, I'm up in Canada, so things do take a little bit longer, but that's definitely a huge difference between the two. And if I was shipping this out, that would definitely be a concern for me with printed mint that people aren't gonna be getting their products very quickly. Um, so let's actually compare the two. So this one over here is printful. This one on this side is printed mint. Uh, first thing we noticed about the packaging, obviously one's in a box, one's in a bag. Um, but actually the printful here, you can see that it's got my logo up top. And when I look at where it was shipped from, it actually has my business name on there. Um, the one from Printed Mint really has nothing to identify who it's from. And when you look at the from address, it doesn't actually have my business name or anything like that on there. So that's the first thing I'm noticing. Uh, I definitely like the way Printful does that more than the Printed Mint. So kind of a point for Printful so far. Let's open it up and see what the t-shirt looks like. Okay, so when we open it up, Printful here has the t-shirt inside and a little plastic film there. And when we open up the printed mint, it has some little bits inside and then the t-shirt again kind of in a plastic film in there. Here's the two shirts. Let's take them out and compare the okay, printed. So here we have the close-up of the shirts. On the left, you have printed mint. On the right, you have printful. So first thing, I actually think the quality of both shirts is really quite good. I've ordered from a couple other companies that just the printing is absolutely horrible. But these ones both turned out fairly well. As you can tell though, the colors are a little bit different. I'm just gonna throw up an image of the original image that I put on the shirt so that you can see the color comparison there. Um, so definitely closer on the printful side there. Both colors do look good, but getting something close to the original is definitely important if you're using digital mockups to sell your products. Uh, if somebody got the one on the left and looked at the image that you were selling, they might not be happy with that color comparison. So I think printful definitely wins on that side of just being more accurate to what I was trying to get. Um, in terms of things that come in the package with it, on the printed mint side, you can see that there's a little garment care tag there, which is pretty cool. I like that they give some washing instructions and stuff so that people don't have to ask about that. On the right, Printful does give a little tag about the apparel. It doesn't really give instructions, but it does say that a little bit of discoloration before washing it is normal. So that might be important for people to know as well. It does, however, give you a packing slip in there. Again, you can see that my logo is on there, uh, which is really nice. You know, it gives it more of that personalized touch. And then it also allows you to add a note at the bottom. So you could include your garment care instructions in there. I always give just a little thank you. Uh, you could give a discount code, remind them to leave a review. So there's tons of stuff you can do with that, which I think adds a nice personal touch there as well. So overall, I'm kind of disappointed with Printed Mint. Um, I really don't think it adds anything in terms of giving it that handmade look or that personalized look. I actually think Printful does a way better job of that. Uh, the fact that they are less expensive, it got here faster, the colors are closer, and really there's nothing wrong with the way that they present it. I'll definitely be sticking with Printful for all my print-on-demand stuff. I hope you guys liked my video. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Thanks guys.